Uh, first, I want to have these three different rings. It's probably not new to you, but I just want to make sure we have the right definition. Right? The real action today is in machine learning and deep learning. Right? And especially in your turf, you know, getting lots amount of data, data finding patterns, recognizing possibilities, matching that with, with human intelligence. I always say when AI, human intelligence, meets AI, AI business as usual is over. Right? We're going to be able to attach ourselves to this huge fire hose of intelligence, right? And here's what I want to use as a definition. Demis Hassabis from DeepMind has the best definition. But it's one that should scare us a little bit. It's computer systems that turn information and data into knowledge. I mean, think about that for a second. He's not talking about you know, being able to uh, achieve our ob objective or any of those things like AI scientists talk about. Right? He's talking about building knowledge. I mean, isn't that what we do? Don't we pride ourselves on knowledge, experience, expertise? So I would say to this quite clearly, computer knowledge, binary knowledge, algorithmic knowledge is powerful, but it's completely different than our knowledge. Think about that when you think about your favorite place in the world that you want to go to. You don't describe it as a GPS coordinate. Right? You have sound, smell, numbers, figures, pictures, all at the same time. This is how we think of the world. So um, just to add some more definitions to this, also making sure we know machine learning is the idea of insights without programming. That's quite familiar. Um, and the next one is uh, deep learning is creating patterns for the use in decision making. And I think that's kind of the holy grail in so many ways. But we can safely say for a machine to reach human level wide understanding of the world, some people would argue that will never happen, and some people are saying it will happen gradually, but you know, Ray Kurzweil, I think, is correct when he says 2050 as the point of that converge 